Laisha, it's good to see you. Be good, sweetie. How was your reunion with Halsey? Thank you, Hazel. Your gift was wonderful. You shouldn't have troubled. You're welcome. We should never have kept you apart for this long. Good evening, Delson. Good evening, Laisha. How are you feeling? I feel great. Better and better since I got my little sugar fangs back. Wonderful. I haven't seen Richard yet. Does he know I've been released from the Institute? No, I'm the Prince. It was my decision. He is your psychiatrist, but you don't need his permission for everything. He wasn't at the party, was he? I'm searching for everyone who's still missing. Don't worry about him. Thank you. Laisha. I know I can be frank with you. For four years, I have been working to heal the city's wounds. You've already helped me avoid traps in the past. That was a long time ago, you know? I can barely- You've helped me to foil conspiracies, make the right decisions for the domain. You're not like the other children of Malkav. Quinton King knew that. The Mad King. I remember, yeah. I had you released from the Institute because your premonitions are the most detailed, the most accurate. I wanted them to help me understand the Chantry's hand more clearly before we signed our agreement with them. But this alert changes everything. I need to understand what's just happened. Did you sense anything, possibly about what happened tonight? I saw images, but they had nothing to do with this party. It didn't make any sense. It was a long, white hallway. It's a little early, for sure, but it's a good start. I'm sorry. I can't be of more help. Don't be sorry. There's something else you can do for me. Your discretion can still be of use to me. I need to be sure that none of the members of my council are going to take advantage of the situation. You don't trust them? You can never be too careful. You and Delson are the only two people I trust entirely. The members of the council have their council lodgings here. It gives them the impression that they have power, and it means I can keep an eye on them. I'm going to give you the key. Go and see if you find anything that could make me doubt their loyalty. Anything that might make me think there's something in the works. Uh, all right. Miss Drury burned the midnight oil to make sure this event was secret. I imagine there might be some evidence in the information she gathered. I need it. All right, consider it done. You've never disappointed me, Laisha. Please don't start today. Until then, I hope to have found more information. But above all, don't share what we've discussed with anyone. I don't need more gossip. Can I take Halsey with me? Of course. All right then. I'll be right back.
So this is where you've been hiding. What? Oh, Jesus, it's you. You scared the shit out of me. How did you find me? You're really bad at covering your tracks. Are you alone? What the hell is going on? Shit, Mum, it's a fucking nightmare. Mom, I'm going to Richard's to see if he has my teddy. Okay. Come and find me when you're done. I hope Journey hasn't come looking for the same thing as me. But this thing's old. Does she still use it? This is what Hazel asked me to bring her. Nobody here. I'm going to be able to take a look around Dijon's. Tarot cards. How fun. The Emperor, the Chariot, Temperance. Easy. Dijon is thinking about taking a trip. Salem Gazette. Just like New Orleans, this is definitely Dijon's place. Uh, this knife has blood on it. It's 
from an animal, and it's still fresh. He must have done a warlock ritual. Well, well, what have we here? He didn't finish his letter, but that'll be enough for Hazel to make up her mind about him. Hazel told me to keep a low profile here. This area is reserved for the prince and her primogen. Shit! Hilda's in her office. She's going to see me. Too close. She might be able to sense me. Why did you come back? Why? Other than to show that you're doing just fine on your own. If you only knew everything I've done for you. Mem. Elda's more concerned with Mem than she is with Hazel. I hope she'll be happy to hear that. The speculative news from... Oh, he's about as fun as his reading material. Leisha! Hmm. Restricted access means nothing to you, I see. Make yourself at home. Don't mind me. 
How am I not surprised? What doesn't surprise you? For you to turn up at a time like this. The prince had me released. Of course, she needs you. <laughs> I'm guessing she sent you to spy on the council. What do you mean? Tell me, do you remember the last time she pulled you out of your musty hole? It's just that I... You don't remember, do you? You're still having those little memory issues, it seems. And I suppose Halsey's here, too. Of course she is. <laughs> the more the merrier. Don't start with me, Beryl. Otherwise... Why don't you go out and play in the sun? And let me get back to work. Work? With everything that's going on. Hazel will appreciate your dedication. Get out! Please! <sighs> that's all I'm going to be able to find out about him. Hazel's going to be disappointed. Oh. Halsey's waiting for me. I hope Hazel will be proud of us. Richard's apartment. <laughs> he didn't change a thing, as usual. A floppy disk. <laughs> That's all Richard knows how to use. Maybe I'll find a way to read it. So, did you find your teddy? No, not yet. I'm not sure he's here. What about you? Did you finish your job for the prince? Yes, I found something that might be of interest to Hazel. Does that mean we're going back to see the prince then? Not quite, Pumpkin. I want to take another look around. You wait for me here, but be good. I will! Nothing. <sighs> it's true that he always saves everything on old media.
He must be hiding somewhere else. Richard must have had a breakthrough, if Hazel's interested in it. Are you almost done? Yes, I found something that might be of interest to Hazel. Does that mean we're going back to see the prince then? Let's go, sugar face. Leisha. I'm all ears. Everything went all right. I knew I could count on you. Was Halsey a good girl? Yes, as usual. Good. Were you able to find anything interesting in Ms. Drury's apartments? Yes. There was intel she had gathered on the guests, including those from the Hartford Chantry. Hmm. Anything about their regent, Deneb Osborne? Yes, he seems to be obsessed with memory magic. Interesting. I gave everything to Delson. Thank you. I'll take a look at it later. Were you able to see or hear anything interesting? Hilda was in her room. She was acting strangely. What do you mean? She was whispering things, talking to a picture of M.M. Touching, but that's of no importance. At Dijon's, I found a letter addressed to the Salem Chantry. Did he betray me for the warlocks? I don't know. It just said that he's participating in your project. But that he would have preferred an agreement with Salem. Oh, I understand his recent illusions a little better now. I'm going to need to have a word with him. Go on. I found Journey in Jara's office. How did she get in there? I don't know. But M.M. joined her. It's like there's no security here. But do go on. I want to know everything. What did you see? They talked, and M.M. told her that you wanted to see her. She told her she had to bring her back. Journey decided to flee. What did M.M. do? There wasn't much she could do to make her stay. She looked very worried about her, too. Or maybe she didn't want to. What an idiot. It's normal for you not to understand the Clan of the Rose's affectation for imitating mortal friendship. It's pitiful. But thank you for letting me know. Was there anything else? That's all I was able to find. I knew I could count on you. Thank you, Leisha. Richard still wasn't there. Were you able to find out anything else? Yes. One of my servants just came back from his bar, the Red Salon, as that's where he does his research. I had hoped to find him there. But she confirmed that Dr. Dunham had gone to the party early with a few of his vessels. I'm sorry, Leisha. No. If he had been destroyed, I would have felt it. I have to go find him. You're the most discreet of all of us, it's true. But we have no idea what might have happened there. It could be dangerous. I won't be alone. Halsey will be with me. Of course. And one last thing. Dr. Dunham wasn't the only one there. There was also Miley, my child. Bring her back to me. Yes, of course. We'll leave right away. I wouldn't expect anything less of you. Thank you, Leisha.